Hi, Mike Bury here with a tip to help you eliminate your slice. One of the most common things I see with people that slice the ball is that their club is working from outside to inside the target line with the club face open through impact. So you'll see here from the face on view that when the golfer does that, the left hand stays on top, right hand underneath, and then we start to get the chicken wing type look on the way through. And that's what produces that curve to the right or that big slice. So today I'm going to give you a drill called the in and over drill that's going to help eliminate that. And there's two parts to that drill. So you'll see from the target line here, the in part relates to the club approaching the golf ball from the inside of the target line. The over part relates to the right hand working over the top of the left through impact. So again, that club approaching the golf ball from the inside of the target line, right hand working over the top of the left. And that's what's going to help produce a straight shot, maybe even a slight draw. You'll see when I do this from the face on view that that club approaches the ball from the inside, right hand over the top of the left. And you'll see here that both arms are fully extended. There's no opening of the face, holding off, chicken wing type look. The, hand, the hands and club are releasing, right hand on top of the left. So when you do this, I'd start off with half swings, do a lot of half swings and build it up into the full swing. So I'll demonstrate here now just a little half swing. Again, that club approaching the ball from the inside, right hand over, just like so. So again, practice a lot of those half swings and then build it up into the full swing. Really important to get that club to travel from the inside of the target line so that we can get the hand to work over the top of the left. That's what's going to help eliminate your slice. Good luck.